Just in, how did Arnold Schwarzenegger's perfect life turn into his wife's worst nightmare? Arnold is a perfect specimen of exactly what Hollywood loves. Who had an affair? Is that the only affair? No. The guy that you thought you lived with all these years turns out to be a different guy. It all started with lies. Why didn't you admit to it then? It's just one of the disastrous situations that I have created. The family has broken up now. We are trying to hold it together. Affairs weren't the only secrets. Today we learned that Schwarzenegger had a child out of wedlock. The affair with his family housekeeper and the son they kept secret. Maria Shriver and the other woman delivering baby boys the same week. Maria was suspicious that the son looked so much like her husband, Arnold. It was just, I think, too scared about losing her. I had to face up to that. Why would you accomplish all that and then f*** it up? It's the worst thing that I've ever done because it hurt so many people. How far back do the lies go? My mother called me on the phone and she said, your dad died. And this was exactly two months before a contest. She says, do you come home to the funeral? I said, no. Growing up, Arnold's dad had forced him to get tough from a very young age. My father would come home drunk, and he would scream and hit us and scare my mother. He said, quote, every time he hit me, every time he disapproved of me or embarrassed me, it put fuel on the fire in my belly. That's right. So I think when I then tapped into this bodybuilding, I thought that that was the ticket to America. And so that's when I then put all my energy into that. At just 20 years of age, Arnold Schwarzenegger became the youngest Mr. Universe in history. But Arnold needed to accomplish more to truly leave his dad behind. My vision was to become a big star and to become not only a big star, but to become the highest paid entertainer in that field. I always believed in making money so that then you can do something with that. You create a family, you give some of your kids. Arnold married Maria Shriver and set out to create the perfect family. The Schwarzeneggers had been trying for a family of their own. In 1989, they welcomed their first of four children. I remember when our first child was born, when Catherine was born. It is so much fun being a dad. And the trick of it is it's just, as you know, it's communication. But when Arnold's career began to take off, he started to lose sight of what really mattered. So I was working in Sacramento and my family was living down here in Los Angeles. And then I flew home, I got home at nine, 10 o'clock at night. One day we were all having dinner. And then all of a sudden my daughter started crying on the dinner table and she said, Daddy, you did not come to my recital today. So then the next kid started crying and saying, yeah, you didn't come to my football game on Saturday. And then the next kid started crying and all of a sudden the whole table was crying. And but you're also trying to be as good a, a husband and as, as a father and all this. Arnold started lying to cover up the weak, scared boy he used to be. One bodybuilder one time told me how he never went home to his father's funeral, how his father died and he just ignored it. My father died three months after a competition in 1972, and uh, I saw him just shortly before he died. So I stored that story. In trying to hide from his painful past, Arnold was turning into his own worst nightmare. Arnold is exactly what Hollywood loves. And Arnold is a perfect specimen. Who had an affair with the actress? Is that the only affair? No, I doubt it. So it's a recurring issue with you. And finally, the biggest lie he'd been keeping for over five years was exposed. Today, we learn that Schwarzenegger had a child out of wedlock. The affair with his family housekeeper and the son they kept secret. Uh, I had to face up to that, which I have been kind of hiding, but no one knew about. Maria Shriver and the other woman delivering baby boys the same week. Today, 21-year-old Katherine Schwarzenegger tweeted, this is definitely not easy. This was, without any doubt, the biggest failure. Maria asked you, why didn't you tell me? And what did you say? That I uh, did not know how to. She started shaking, and she had tears in her eyes. You know, it's very difficult. I was just, I think, too scared about losing her. Arnold realized he was hurting his kids as much as his dad had hurt him. I did not hold him totally responsible because I was doing the same thing. It all started with lies. Why didn't you admit to it then? I just didn't know how. But the bottom line is it's just one of the disastrous situations that I've uh, created, and it's the worst thing that I've ever done. It hurt so many people. The family has broken up because of that. Now we are trying to hold it together. How do you say to your kids, please, let's not destroy everything here? How do you how do you do that? By putting his family first, he did what his dad never could. He faced his mistakes and fixed them. Now you have to start thinking about your family. 
Mm. What does that mean to your kids? Yeah. What does it mean to the whole family when you all of a sudden dedicate yourself fully? And that is something that I will always look back and say, uh, how could you have done that? Have your children forgiven you? I cannot tell you, but I hope they, they will. It's time to rebuild the trust again and everything and that, doing everything that they can to work on that. If you have the choice between data, media coverage versus you know, doing something for your family. I'd rather do something for the family. He has since mended his relationship with all four kids. Their daughter, Katherine Schwarzenegger, shared this pic celebrating her 27th birthday with the whole family. Thank you to my amazing family for making this birthday one for the books. I think the only way it happens is if all of you work together. I'm one of the fortunate ones. You are. That we have really great, great kids. But including my fifth child. He's terrific. Father and son are close. Joseph is Arnold's spitting image. He wants to follow in his dad's footsteps. Acting is a huge goal of mine. Bodybuilding is a huge goal of mine. We get along really well. The most important thing is that the kids are doing well. And after rebuilding the relationship with his children, Arnold looks forward to a better tomorrow. Congratulations, you're about to be a, a grandpa. Can, can you believe that? And also, are you gonna go by the name grandpa? Grandpa or the opa. In German, it's Opa. You really have to get creative and have a clear vision of where you want to go and what you want to do. You got to just always improve and look at what can you do to improve your life. That is what creates kind of life in you and therefore more enthusiasm and you have a much more positive outlook in life.